welcome back to the uh, Midwest Sports Show. Hello. Now we know what kind of person you are. You're not a friend when someone's hurt and <laughs> you put up the Cubs. Oh, my God. Gene, mm. there is no... Uh, there is no, uh, what do you call it, sugarcoating the truth. Yeah. Wow. Right? Nothing here. Uh, you know, Gene, if we uh, if we were going to go easy on the Cubs, right? people would call us uh, soft. Well, I mean, I was very disappointed, but I, I uh, gosh, they, they lost nine, nine in a row when they needed to win a few. And I was at, I was at the game where they really, uh, the Cardinals came at Wrigley, but yeah, it's so sad. And I kept watching yeah. them. I go, I, I let me just quit them. Just I, let me. They're they're playing for not. Let me just let them go. But I still watched them all the way to the painful end. You're trying to get out, but they kept yeah, drawing you then, back and in. And then they won two games against the Cardinals. I go, yeah, stick it to the Cardinals. Give the Brewers a division. All right. And then well, we are getting way ahead of ourselves, okay. and uh, I don't have my phone either, so that's uh, oh, that may hurt. Sorry. But it's a okay. Yeah. Uh, well, Gene, we uh, we'll talk about the uh, sadness of the uh, Cubs uh, in a mm. short time here. Uh, but first of all, uh, let's talk about the name of the show. Oh, okay. And uh, bring sadness to all the uh, you would never, listeners. Oh, it is up there. Yeah. Okay. You're gonna hear in a second. Yeah. Oops. Um, yeah. So this is the uh, the Midwest Sports Show, mm. and uh, my name is uh, Chris Stotts, and then that is uh, Gene Steichen. I guess the Cubs are in well. the Midwest, so you have to talk about them. Hey. But can I say congratulations to the Cardinals? <laughs> the football Cardinals or the Yeah. Uh, I, I they they tied one game. So good job Cardinals. As far as the baseball Cardinals. Oh boy. Yep. Yeah. All right, well hold on a second. Let me get my phone. I think I'll do that. Well, let me let me say to the Cardinal fans. I I'm sorry. Maybe I'm jealous. Maybe I'm just not being a good person. I'm I'm rooting for the Brewers. They're <coughs> They're the team uh, I'm I'm for now. Go Brewers, Cardinals. It's just too much, right? David, cousin David, anybody out there? How can you root for the uh, Cardinals? Gene, you you starting to sound like Trump tweeting well, to I'm himself saying, here. I I'm supporting because I I like Wisconsin. I love Milwaukee. I spent a lot of time there. I was just I was there a few weeks ago, and I was just in uh, Green Bay last week. Yeah, Wisconsin's great. Go Brewers. Okay, all right. That's still right, painful, Gene. but no. Oh. All right. Well, Gene, we have a lot to talk I about, did say including the uh, the conclusion to the uh, Major League Baseball season. Yeah. And uh, we'll get all into that, until, including the playoffs preview. Oh, boy. And uh, we'll go over uh, NFL week four. Mm. Already a quarter of the season gone. Yeah. Done. It's been great. Wow. What an exciting season. The it's Bears are in it. Packers are in it. Packers are good. That was a tough loss more, last week. What mm. more do you need, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, you know what we need? Oh. We, no, need, we uh, need some baseball. Huh? Oh, da- hey, Joe, thank you. Okay. This guy, <laughs> I will say thank you. And please, I'm mixed on this one because I don't want to lose Joe. We lost him, so he's gone. All right. They're going to do something else. But please, Joe. Oh, if you're with the Angels, I hope you make them better. But don't don't coach a National League team and beat the Cubs. Please don't do All that. All right. Well, Gene, let's That's start. Not his fault. Let's start chronologically. Okay. From the very beginning. Mm. And uh, what we we did the show what on Sunday night last night? Yeah, Monday. And or was it Monday night? Oh, and what yeah, was whenever. it? Whenever. When I was out, I was out of town. Yeah, I was in Chicago. It was after the Green Bay game. Yep. Yeah. You know what? Now the stupid app is not working. For oh, my, it was uh, Monday. It was Monday. Uh, yeah, I was in a uh, beautiful Elk Grove Village. And, all right, is, like, and uh, we were. I think the I think the Brewers were ahead of the Cubs in the wild card at the time, yeah. right? Yeah. And then uh, you had a series. You had two series, right? Was it? No. Yeah, it was one we series. we had one. Cubs have won a bunch. Of, now it's them. Okay, I'm gonna, I have to distance myself emotionally. Uh, they had won a bunch of games in a row. Then they lost two games to the Reds at home. Then the Cardinals came in, and uh, so and the Cardinals beat them four straight, all by one run. So by the time you talked to me, they had lost six straight games. Yeah, and they were out of it then by last week. And then they continued to get swept by the Pirates, which is okay. almost <laughs> impossible. 
they're the car. All right, so oh they had. God. So they ended up losing nine. Okay, three. again, let let's reset this because my uh, okay. I'm way out of this. My app is right. completely screwed up. Mm. So they won. They won two. No, no, no. They they got swept at home at Wrigley, or did they? Yeah, they lost two to the Reds. Then they got swept by the Cardinals. So they lost their last six games at Wrigley. Right, and then so, and then meanwhile, Brewers are yeah. sweeping the Pirates. They're yep. sweeping the Marlins, and uh, it's going to be an epic showdown in the last week. Yeah, very last week. Mm. Um, the Brewer again. The Brewers playing the Reds. They swept the Reds. Uh, Cubs are playing the Pirates. Probably one of the worst teams uh, by far, right, in the league. And uh, was it a four game? It was three games, right? Yeah, they swept the Pirates at home, and then they went on the road and got swept by the Pirates. How, Gene? And I, I texted you. Yeah. How, how, do they give up? Like wh- oh, wh- what? What happened? Part, Were there injuries? That was sad. What's when going they on? Went to Pittsburgh. I've never seen the Cubs so disheartened, and so they weren't exactly playing for their manager to keep him. <laughs> he was already gone. I think all year they had planned on. Didn't they, they didn't really get rid of him. They, they he. This was the last year of his contract. He had a five year contract. Yeah, that was ugly. I and I why I I I don't know why I made myself watch that. I mean, it was so disheartening. They lost to the Pirates one game, they seven to one. They gave up seven runs in the inning and they committed five errors. I was like, hey, good job, guys. Yeah, hey, how about some fundamentals, Joe? How just, about that? Just, P- just put the put the petting zoo on hold, Joe. Oh my gosh, and the let's uh, so let's do air. some drills. Oh, huh? It was like that all year. Yeah. All mm-hmm. right, and then so. Uh, yeah, so not looking good for the Cubs. They're pretty much out of it. No, at that, that point. they were gone. They Brewers, were gone. Brewers are again on a surge. Uh, they're three. No, no, no. I think they're one game behind. Yeah, the Cardinals. Right, right, right. And the Brewers need uh, the Cubs to beat the Cardinals at least twice. Yeah, and the Cubs have lost. Like that. The Cubs have lost nine straight, but they went into St. Louis and, and they things, w- won the first thing, two. But Gene, let's, again, we gotta set this up. Oh. Things were not looking good for that oh, because I want to get to with the Cubs out of playoffs. Madden wasn't playing his A line. Oh, and he singled out the Brewers in St. Think Louis. Suck on this, Brewers. So Brewers can start their bitching now. Of course, they're going to bitch, and I get that. But quite frankly, there's certain things I really don't give a shit about, and that would be one of them. Mm. So was, it, it looks like uh, Joe Madden is single-handedly trying to sabotage right. the Brewers' uh, playoff chances. Not very yeah. neighborly. Not exactly. I guess you hate the uh, Brewers more than the St. I Louis. I guess so. But then the Cubs, and they didn't play anybody. I mean, they played uh, – their guys were they were they played they all were, the young guys right yeah yeah all the guys that just got called up and they still beat St. Louis and what, the once you know two. they win two games yep. against the Cardinals back to back yep and things are really looking good for the Brewers but but oh, the Brewers oh they lost a they lost they game. lost a Friday game but this Saturday including a uh, grand slam uh, yeah. uh, by the Rockies. However, they didn't make it close, 7 to 11 at the end, but just could not uh, right. match it. Um, and then on Saturday, oh boy. when the Cubs were up 8 to 6 and the Cubs were finishing off St. Louis, the Brewers were up with two, two, outs. two to 1 uh, no. against the Rockies with uh, two outs. Uh, Hader, Josh Hader pitching the best closer in the yeah. uh, Major League Baseball. Threw a high fastball that was like 97, very, very high. Mm. The uh, whoever oh, was it, um, who was it? I'm trying to figure out. Oh my god, uh, Hilliard, yeah. Hilliard, this yeah. guy, this, yeah. he just he's, he's a brought he brought up, yeah, from the uh, minors. Hey. I think it's like 36 right. uh, home runs. He might be the rookie of yeah. the year actually this right. year. Hits a home run off Josh Hader, ties the game. Josh Hader gave up a lot of home runs this year. Well, it's, it's feast or famine with uh, yeah. Josh Hader. Hey, may I, um, and then. Go ahead. And then uh, the Rockies uh, won it overtime and extra yeah. innings, 10. That that was a division. The Cubs, three. the Cubs did all they could for you. And then the Cubs turned around and said, if you're not going to take advantage of our, our good hardness, then we're going to lose 9 nothing Screw in the you last guys. game. Yep. And then Joe Madden really didn't play anybody on Sunday. Well, and then they announced uh, that morning, the next morning, Sunday morning, that Joe Madden is not returning. Yeah, yeah, they met after. Oh, yeah. Then so the Cubs' final game as a tribute to Joe Madden, they went out and <laughs> lost nine to nothing. Good job, guys. Oh, yeah, way, to, I, way to end your tenure. May I say to our Yankees fans, Jim, uh, good luck. I'm not really rooting for the Yankees. I I've already sworn allegiance to the Brewers because they're our neighbors. But yeah, if the Yankees win, what's uh, that'll just be 28 titles. Who cares? 
Well, a lot of people care. So, uh, yeah, that it, it's painful with the Yankees too because they got they got um, Glaber Torres from the Cubs, and he's just a superstar. Um, yep. Cubs traded right. away so many young guys. So, um, yeah. Painful. So Joe Madden not coming back. No. It's apparently uh, after Saturday night's game, split a bottle of wine with Theo Epstein. Yeah, that's how they got can't, started. Can't 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 imagine what that was like. Mm. If you could be a fly in the room for that, I don't know if I want to see. I that. say the Cubs must be planning on hiring David Ross, who's how their many, manager. Otherwise, why? What is their master how, plan? How, how many min, How many glasses of wine do you think it took before uh, Joe took his pants off? <laughs> Wait, wait a in the hotel second. room. Oh, I don't know. Were they, were they in Chicago? I can't remember. No, they were in St. Louis. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, I have no idea what, what's a hotel in St. Louis. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so I guess, I guess it was a mutual decision that uh, he's not coming back. Yeah. And, well, it, wasn't, uh, it was mutual only because they made it look better. But Joe didn't want to go anywhere. He loved oh, What are you joking? Of course he did. He didn't want to stay. He was oh done with this gosh. team. Oh my gosh! Yeah. Oh. I mean, look, look what he did. He. Uh, I was gonna say, are they wearing blackface in a sports center commercial here? No, but they're. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Uh, but no. Uh, yeah. So, but yeah, Joe. Joe would have uh, negotiated for a contract extension, right? No, they didn't offer him one. They were never. Oh, really? They were never there. This was it. This was a World well, Series or bust. They, I thought, they wanted to change. I thought Joe's passive aggressive maneuver for uh, not doing his starters over the weekend. I thought that was him saying, "Hey, th- these bums, you got me playing." I I think so. Uh, I I'm, suck. I, they're, they're overpaid. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What am I supposed to do with these bombs? I, I think you're right. And oh, thanks for Craig Kimbrell. Sucks. I mean, look at <laughs> Kimbrell. Almost they brought him in halfway through the year, and he torpedoed the season. <laughs> I mean, for goodness. And they almost like, like thirty million a year or twenty five yeah, like, a year or something. Uh, Joe's saying, Theo, what the what the hell? What, what we you, need you, this guy? What what are you doing to me? Bringing it. Uh, I'd rather have Chapman on this team, right? Yeah. So this fucking oh, guy. Oh my gosh. Yeah. At least Chapman had pr- produced results. Yeah, it was ugly. So good luck to Joe, but not don't go to a National League team, Joe. That's going to be too painful. So yeah, everyone's talking about him. I would uh, go to the Angels, Mike yeah, Trout. Go to the Angels, or uh, I, I'm saying the Mets. How about why not the Mets? No, I he could, yeah, sure, but don't because then it'll be painful if they win. How about no, the Yankees? What to, if the Yankees hire Yankees? Him? No, they're fine. What they're if the good. Yankees f- uh, flame out in they're the gonna, uh, wild card? Yankees, it's going to be Yankees, Brewers in the World Series. There you go. Uh, okay. Can the Texans, Texans, or not the Texans, but uh, the Astros are way better than the Yankees. But yeah. Well, they're both. No, they're both uh, really good. So the, the Cubs season is over. Nine in a row to yeah. end out the season. Just right. like last year, how they lost three out of the they last four. They just collapsed the last two years. I know. Absolutely. Yeah. Just a bunch of uh, old guys uh, well, with duct tape. They were young and, uh, two, three years ago when they won. Now they're starting to become like, what the hell's going on with these guys? Well. To, uh, you see, you ever see uh, the freshman fifteen gene? You know, uh, go to no. school in the Midwest. Uh-uh. You, you you come in you, the college, you looking like nice, yeah. fine, yeah. trim, big mm. boobs, Wait a nice second. ass. What? No, and then uh, a little too much uh, mm. cafeteria food I don't think so. in Chicago. All right. Mm. Too many beers, too many old styles. All right, okay. and all of a sudden, uh, not looking so pretty anymore. Huh? Oh my gosh. Well, okay. I think. Well, the, I hope, but uh, Theo, I, this is where he's got to earn his money because th- he's still got. <laughs> he's he's got to put a miracle. You know, <laughs> I don't he's got no he, money to to I earn, so uh, yeah, at least the season. Well, they there. gave him a lot, and he spent it on crappy. Mm, it's all okay, gone. Uh, that's, I mean, this is got the, the kind of moves that the Yankees would do. Yeah. Uh, when they would panic and uh, try to compete, they would right. just throw money all the way all over the place. At least, at least it, for me, I'm glad it's over. It was just, it was hard to watch. It was just too much. Okay, so good luck. I say good luck <laughs> to the Brewers and good luck to the Cardinals, uh, football Cardinals, all even right. though I don't like them either. All right, and then, Gene, another uh, milestone before we move on from the Cubs. On Friday, WGN, their last Cubs oh game. Oh, my gosh. I grew up watching WGN. I uh, I remember going to my grandma's after uh, third grade. Yes. And uh, watching the Cubs that's on how, w- the that's Superstation. That's why Cubs are a national team, because of WGN. With uh, Ryan Sandberg, Joe Girardi, yeah, yeah. Mark Grace, Air, oh uh, Andre gosh. Dawson. The Red Baron. Mar- was that Mark? Was it, uh, who was uh, Maddox, one of the Maddox brothers, was it Greg or yeah, Greg? He, Greg that's, Maddox. Yeah, he. That's where he got to start. Then he left us for Atlanta. Yeah, yeah. really, really started to win. 
Oh my god. And Harry Carey. Harry Jack Brickhouse was there first, and then Harry Carey came in. I was and, uh I was coming home from third grade and Harry Carey already had four beers in him. Oh my god. He and it wasn't it wasn't Urban Legend. Apparently he had a cooler up there, Budweiser <laughs> and yeah, he he liked to drink in there. It's like uh grandma, why is the uh man with big glasses uh, slurring his words? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh well. He had he had to he had to drink there he had a lot of bad teams he was calling <laughs> he there's a couple good years but mostly it's really bad so no wonder oh boy yeah all right so uh, goodbye WG. Joe Madden WG is WG done made us all fans running home from school and catching the last couple innings in WGN yep Bozo yeah. well what's up Bozo yeah, is yeah, Bozo, Bozo still on the air Sunday energy? morning I no he's gone but wow that was a Jeez. big big part of our childhood as well yes. Yep. On the bus here. Okay, all right, Brewers. and then uh, maybe the lighter side of things here are the Brewers. Okay, I'm all in. Brewers go to Washington. Just win. Don't, you're, you're going up against Scherzer. Well, after getting swept by the Rockies, uh, maybe that's a nice little uh, ass pounding there. Yeah. Uh, and by the way, the uh, Sunday game went 13 innings. Ooh. I'm sure the uh, in Colorado actually uh, tied the game in the bottom of the ninth. I'm sure the Brewers are trying to get the hell out of Dodge. Yes, absolutely. Especially because you see the Cubs are getting their ass kicked. Yeah, so uh, no one wants to uh, play 13. There's a couple games that went extra innings on yeah. uh, Sunday, right? So, uh, okay, so no Brewers one wants to do go that. to D.C. You just so, beat yeah, the zone. Brewers were at least trying to uh, play the Cardinals today for the uh, division. That did not happen. No. So they were playing the Nationals on the 1st as you uh, watch this, October 1st. Uh, which is Tuesday at five oh eight PM. I'm gonna be uh trying to skip out work early and go into a bar to watch that game. All right. It's on TBS. Yeah. Woodruff is starting pitcher. He probably won't last too long. They'll probably pull him pretty quick. Man against Scherzer. Max Scherzer. The Brewers gotta be such under but they've been underdogs and they keep winning. But they're a huge underdogs tomorrow because Scherzer at home. Mm, I think we've beaten Scherzer a couple times, so yeah. I don't think we're too worried about that. All it's right. just that. Well, yeah, go get him. Um, yeah, I'll tell you what. This may be the best game of all the playoffs, Gene. Yeah, it's pretty great. Imagine and these two teams you, slugging it out for nine well, innings. Well, how about that? Brewers got to go to D.C., and then if they win, oh, guess what? Hello, Dodgers. Dodgers, yep. Yeah. Playing Dodgers. So. You can beat the Dodgers. Yeah, plus Dodgers will have a couple days off. They'll it's, uh, you know they'll go out but, to the but, nightclub but, around here. Oh yeah, LA. Brewer, Brewers. If Brewers win, they earned it. Yeah, this will be a, yeah. And plus, yeah. it's a th- it's a well, you gotta win three games. It's a five game series, so yeah. uh, I, I think this actually works out pretty well for the Brewers. So they'll be yeah. If they win tomorrow, then they'll pr- they'll probably play in L.A. Thursday, I guess. Yeah, so they play in LA Thursday and they play in LA Friday. I'm gonna try to go to that Friday game. We'll see. Yeah. We'll see how tickets are. If the Brewers win the first game, I think just tickets will be wait. way cheaper. Yeah, you just wait them out on StubHub and and uh, wait till about game time. And then game three would be on Sunday in Milwaukee if mm. Milwaukee does win. So uh, let's close it out in Milwaukee, huh? Yeah. How about that? Yeah, Packers are out of town finally. Ugh. So. Uh, yeah, Brewers will Cardinals. Have to stay to them Cardinals are playing the Braves on Thursday. Yeah, that's. That's going to be a tough series. Yeah, Braves, Braves are, are good. good. But Cardinals are pretty scrappy. I don't know. It's hard. I can't root for Atlanta. But, it, okay, I'll, 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 I'll save St. Louis. You can beat the Braves. Go ahead. Yeah, how about that? A Cubs, uh, I'm sorry, a Brewers, Cardinals, uh, and I'll see us. Yeah, why not? It'll be pretty good. Yeah. Pretty entertaining. All right. So, uh, yeah, Gene, any uh, – any predictions? Well, I th- I hope the Brewers can go into D.C. and beat, beat Scherzer. Why not? I mean, I, I'm telling you, if you're in the playoffs, you can win the World Series. Oakland can, or I don't think, well, Tampa Bay. Uh, well, we'll see. But, yeah, sure, Oakland or uh, Brewers or Cardinals, any of these guys can win. Dodgers are far superior all year in the National League. But that it's a, the Dodgers have won the division seven straight years. And what do they have to show for it? Zip. Uh, Nada. Tell you what, Gene, in the playoffs, it's a whole new ball. Game. It is. I'm How telling you, you get a hot pitcher, a couple. You need two hot pitchers. You're going play. Yep. Yep. All right. So uh, there you go. Okay. We already did the playoffs yeah. preview. So there you go. All right. So baseball, uh, pretty interesting stuff. Yeah. All right. So let's talk about the NFL week four. Mm. Here we go. Uh, it started on Thursday. Boy, um, Philly at Green Bay again. I was working and I went to a bar uh, after work, and I tell you what, there's nothing like watching a football game at a bar 
Yeah. Ordering two for one drinks and having two big beers in front of you. Wow. And knowing you got to finish those uh, before halftime so that you can uh, take the train back home. That was uh, my plan. Awesome. Good so, plan. So uh, <laughs> I like to, uh, yeah, I like to say so myself. Uh, Gene, the uh, Eagles players. Yeah. Very dirty. Man, I hated what they did. Greg, is this Greg Williams? The uh, uh, no, it's uh, yeah, Chevallo, right? Or yeah, uh, the yeah. the former Lions coach, oh, right? Yeah. What's the guy's uh, name? I don't know. Chiviano. Yeah, I know who you're talking about. Something like man, that. I wouldn't have let if I was a Packer player. I wouldn't have let that guy from Philly go go uh, over approach my guy when he's on the card. Like, yeah, get like the stay hell away. Out of you're here, the one dude. that did this. Well, first of all, the kickoff uh, the Packers received guy got hit in the head yeah. by the guy tackling him. And then the first play from scrimmage, um, right? It was it is it Aaron Jones or something Williams? I got these two running backs yeah, mixed I'm up, not but, sure. uh, but basically the guy was getting shot. tackled. Dude hit the he hit crown down. of his helmet on two, the side two, of his head. Two guys were holding him already up, engaged, and then, and then that guy comes in right on the side of the head. Just a crazy, cheap, just such a cheap shot. I I'm telling you, if I was on the Packers, which I've not ever been invited to be around them or on the sideline. I would have got. I would have been like, dude, you're not getting anywhere near our play. I don't yeah. care if you need to feel better by approaching. Get out of here. Yeah. Right. Yep. You, you, exactly. Yeah. Uh, you feel bad now, huh? How about uh, when you're slamming the crown of your head into his ear hole? What How a about cheap that? Shot. Just, I mean, these guys, these guys. Hey, listen. Yeah, I know your opponents, but you're also. I mean, your fellow competitor. You guys might be on the next same team That's next year. Right. Von, hey, Vontez Burfitt thought yeah. that was a dirty hit. Uh, yeah, right. I mean, I'm surprised this guy didn't get suspended. That was terrible. But uh, I just hate stuff like that. Yeah. Yep. All right. And then, uh, but you know what, Gene? Does, doesn't phase A-Rod. He uh, turns it on. I'll tell you what, Gene, after watching a bunch of uh, Vikings games and Bears games, it's nice to have a quarterback that can actually make throws. Right, right. It's actually competent. Yeah, that was so exciting. I'm, I'm sorry to lost, but wow, what a great... Yeah, it's good. It's good to see him so good. And Gene, when I was writing down my notes, I think I was a little intoxicated because uh, I, I wrote down, I feel blessed to be a fan of this team. <laughs> yeah. I think that's when uh, Rodgers uh, tied the game at the uh, Jimmy Graham 27-all. Uh, uh, so uh, I was pretty happy about that. Um, the pass interference, again, this stuff is pretty crazy. There's a couple of plays I, uh, on both sides I, of the if, team. If you're a coach, you just can't challenge pass interference. You're throwing away. Even even when I said it, I was like, don't challenge that. They're not going to help you. They're, they're not going to build, well, right? When a guy is not they're, looking at the ball and has his hand in the other guy's face. I know. I mean, it's blatant, And that doesn't get checked. That gives an overturn. That, that, that means that they're not interested in uh, – why did they got that? Why did they put it part of a challenge if that – yeah, of course. But now I wouldn't challenge him. So Would reactionary, you? huh? Unless the guy. How about we done. just get away with pass interference and let's just let's just let these guys play, huh? Yeah. If you tackle the guy, it's pass interference. I mean, but all these guys are just hitting each other with their hands, anyways, right? Yeah, Trying to right, get position. Right. How about right. if you tackle the guy, it's pass interference. Anything else goes, huh? Yeah. How about no that? Challenge. By the yeah. way, Peyton Manning, you're the one that caused all this bullshit because mm. you're complaining because the uh, New England uh, defensive backs. We're all over your guys. You complained 20 years ago because you couldn't beat Tom Brady and Bill Belichick, and here we are. Yeah, look what you've caused. Yep. You've stirred up a hornet's nest. Or and then so yeah. uh, the Devontae Adams got hurt. He was having a great night. He hurt his toe. Hopefully he'll be back soon. Yeah. Um, but we already talked about the, the Packers running back getting knocked out the very first play, and uh, it was pretty obvious the Packers were struggling. Uh, within 10 yards, within five yards, because they ran basically four pass plays uh, right in a row, and they're pretty much trying to shove it into Jimmy Graham's right, right. Uh, hands, trying to have him jump, and uh, did not really work very well, and uh, Aaron Rodgers actually leading him down to tie the game, uh, but through an interception. Um, well, it was more like a, a tip pass that right, got intercepted, right. so... Uh, yeah, so uh, he just didn't have anything. He didn't have anyone to throw it to. No one to run the ball. But are you telling me you don't have a fullback like Matt? Yeah, Matt Lafleur. There, let's, let's, there was a lot of. Uh, let's get John Kuhn on the phone, huh? Yeah, people. That one was pretty, pretty bad. Pretty yeah, bad. Yeah. All right. So but they'll uh, bounce back. They're at the, what a Green game Bay next loses. week. They're at the Cowboys. Yeah, it should be a pretty big game. So then Huge. they got a nice little mini buy. So they yeah. all uh, should be healthy. So who knows? Hopefully, Devontae Adams will play. Yeah. Maybe a uh, cop can uh, come over. Remember last time Aaron Rodgers was at the Cowboys? That g- game a couple years ago? Yep. Miracle game. Doesn't have wow. Jody uh, 
Right. Uh, Jody yeah. Nelson anymore. So maybe Jody can. Uh, Jordy. Why am I yeah, saying Jordy. Jody? Maybe yeah. Jordy can uh, come out, come back. We need you, Jordy. Jordy. All right. Well, I know you got to get out of here quick, so we will. Uh, we'll move right along here. Um, all right, Minnesota at uh, Chicago. I I didn't see. I saw the replay. No, where I oh I. When the Bears were playing, I was like, I really want to watch this game. Oops, I had tickets to Little Shop of Horrors at the Pasadena Playhouse. I, you know what? I got to remind myself, don't schedule musicals on Sunday football well, afternoon. It's counter-programming, Gene. Yeah, it was a great. It's it was counter great. It was great. But so, Gene, you, like, you watch Autry instead of Kirk Cousins? Yes, Autry, yes. And then I saw, I saw Trubisky got hurt. I saw the play. It was a good play. It was like by the first him. play. Yeah, he threw it a couple passes. Uh, it was a great play by Minnesota. Great. And, uh, yeah, so Trubisky got hurt. Dislocated his shoulder. Will not need surgery. He might right. be back in a couple of weeks. Uh, but, Gene, we were talking about this uh, a couple of weeks yeah, ago. Yeah, Chase how, how, how long is it going to be before Trubisky gets uh, benched? Well, wow. the fates intervened. And, hey, uh, I'll tell you. He got hurt. Chase, Chase Daniels came in. He's never done anything in the league, but he he played pretty well. <laughs> he can throw the ball <laughs> yeah, to an I know, open receiver. Exactly. And the receivers are like, thanks for throwing us the ball. And if he's going to be like, if he plays good against Oakland, oh, uh, there's no they're, rush yeah, to get he's, Trubisky Yeah, back. they're not going to bring. Yeah, people are saying like, oh, yeah, Trubisky should be back in a couple. Of, like, what? What? What are no. you talking about? What's his credential? Nicky's not going to bring back Trubisky if Chase Daniels no, is a competent no. quarterback. He's going to – because Trub Chase Daniels, if he can throw – I mean, yeah, you're right. I mean, Minnesota's probably hoping the same thing. Now, Kirk Minnesota Cousins. wanted Chase Daniels. Yeah, yeah, answer. as opposed to Kirk Cousins, who seems like he's a disaster. I didn't – so I didn't really see any of the game. So right. Chase Daniels did throw a TD after uh, Trubisky got hurt. Gene, let me ask you this. Is this just like when Mikowski got hurt and Brett Favre stepped in? Oh. Are we in a new era? Yeah. If Chase Daniels is Brett Favre, then, uh, oh, boy, that is pretty amazing. All right. So the Bears do uh, – the. I don't think the Vikings scored at all, right? It was uh, 16. Six points. Oh, do they? All right. Six, uh, 16 Kirk, to 6. Kirk Cousins looked terrible. Again. What Very is going bad. On with so that bad guy? that uh, his own receivers are taking shots oh, at yeah, him. Oh, yeah, yeah. Saying that uh, uh, I was wide open, you just got to make the ball. You just got to throw the ball. Did you see uh, that play? The one where the guy, I saw that throw. Thielen? And I was like, what the hell? Would, yeah, to Thielen. Wide open, no throwing? pressure. Right, right. Could not do it. And uh, Thielen saying that, yeah, we can't run the ball 180 yards every single time. We need what to make they passes. Do? They owe him $30 million next year. They hey. signed him to 84. Oh, my God. Winning, winning is more important than money, Gene. Remember that. Yeah, they well, backed who's, up the Who's their backup, though? Ombre. I don't think they – Tavares know. Jackson, is he still running around? Yeah, that one Who I knows? can't help you with. And then, uh, Gene, no Rakan Smith. Rokon Smith. That is very odd. Now the drama deepens. He and was no at the game on the sideline, deactivated, and they said he might not – they might keep him deactivated for next week. So now there's all kinds of wild rumors on his wow, misbehaving. He, that play, the guy got hurt, but he didn't even really look like he yeah, got yeah. Hit, hit in the head. Oh, but, maybe his head fell in uh, uh, Menegi said there's personal issues going on. I, that's weird because not acting like himself. Yeah, that's scary. Who's he acting? Mm, what? I don't know. He came from Alabama. Remember last year he's a rookie, held out all training camp, and I don't he know. Lost his playbook, lost his iPad. I but remember the guy that, right? that replaced. Yes, absolutely. And the guy that replaced him was really good. He had two sacks, I think. Yeah. Oh boy. All, All right. right, something's going on. And then uh, really quick, Bears running back Terry Cohn revealed a bit more than he intended to when he took a video from the team's locker room after oh Bunny Night's God. win over Washington. Yeah. Cohn's video featured guard Kyle Long in the background without any clothes on, <laughs> which made for a pretty serious faux pas, even yeah. if the video itself didn't violate the league right, rules right, about posting right, social right. media before the post right. game, blah, blah, blah. Uh, let me just say this, Gene. I saw the video. Yeah. Kyle Long. Right. That's just a name. Just just a name. Oh Kyle Long, just gosh. a name. Oh, I didn't. I didn't. Just I, a name. No, I didn't see any of it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Just a name. All right. All good right. for you. All right. And then, uh, so, I don't know. We can. Um, Bears are good, though. But if their offense, their offense only has to be average, and it can be really good. Yep. Yeah. All right. Baltimore played Cleveland. Uh, just really quick. Uh, uh, Rex Ryan. Mm. Uh, tore into uh, Baker Mayfield saying he's overrated as hell. Yeah. Or maybe it was Baker that said Rex Reagan. I think they both no, said No, Rex Reagan says he's other. overrated as hell, right? Yeah, and Baker yeah, came yeah. back, whatever. 
If you don't wear orange and brown, you don't matter. And Rex Ryan doesn't have any colors right now for a reason. Mm. Ouch. Ouch. Well, hey, hey, Rex, you're not, you're not a big fan of Baker Mayfield. How, how about his feet, huh? Oh. Have, you, have you seen his feet? Okay. Wow. Hey, I'll tell you one thing. <laughs> Odell's not he had a He only got two catches yesterday for 20 yards. That ain't going to sit well. I don't care if Browns win every game. He's going to start making a fuss pretty soon. Because I don't know if he's all in on the team concept. He likes, right? Yeah, I know. Yeah. We'll see. But good for Cleveland. Maybe there's hope. All right, and then just really quick, uh, Kansas City uh, played Detroit in a, in, in a they fun might game. Be good, huh? Lots of turnovers, lots of fumbles. Uh, it was Mahomes' first game indoors, so uh, it took a little while for him to get acclimated. But uh, he ended up uh, going down and getting the winning drive. But so, do you think Detroit's good? Uh, I think they're dangerous, and I think they're definitely going to beat uh, so they, they, the Packers, I think, probably in Detroit. Man, the division's tough, aren't they? Because all the teams are good. You don't got a Miami. God, look at the Patriots. They got they got Miami and the they Jets. They got six, the same. six easy wins right there Yeah, I mean, every single crazy. year. This year, Buffalo was scrappy. But, man, the, the Central or the – man, you got Bears the and Vikings. The North. These guys are good. Power division. Yeah, so. it's great. So it's gonna be pretty exciting. So yeah, it should be a uh, so yeah. Bears and Packers are three and one. Yeah. Uh, Packers play uh, Dallas next week, as already discussed. Yeah. Bears are in London. We're yeah, the, the, Raiders, the Raiders, right? Right, right, right. Perfect, perfect. Uh, has already been sent back home. Isn't that great? Sent, sent. Isn't that just the best? Go home. <laughs> Go home and think back. about what you've done. And he was only a one-year deal. I hope. I, I oh boy, please. Just keep them Go, uh, Why don't you go freeze your feet? Him and Antonio Brown. How do you sign those two guys in the same offseason? Well, it was funny because they uh, they showed all the, um, what do you call it, all the suspensions he's had before. He got suspended for hitting Antonio Brown yeah. in a cheap shot. Yeah, in the playoff, in so, the playoff uh, game. I guess they were buddies when they were in Oakland. So I guess, oh, uh, I guess he hit him pretty hard on yeah. the head. So, all pretty right. Pretty awesome. All right, so that's the week of sports. Hey, next week at this time, uh, hopefully – all of the Brewers, Brewers will be in the, the next round. Or either in the next round or playing, getting them ready for game five at Dodger Stadium. Yep. Something like that. Yep. Maybe we'll uh, broadcast live from Dodger All Stadium. Right. Who knows? We'll Go see Brewers. About that. All right. So, uh, yeah, once again, thanks for everyone for watching and listening, um, as always. And to all my Midwestern friends, because I was back there. It's so awesome. I love the Midwest. It was great. I was in Iowa, Wisconsin, and Illinois last time. And now you're back. Now you. Uh, but I'm going back next week again. All right. So for Gene Steichen, my name is Chris Stotts. It's the Midwest Sports Show. We'll see you guys next week. Bye. Fantastic.